Welcome to Nerd Wars, and you guessed it, Kotaku's Alyssa Mercante is continuing her rampage. She is doing her crusade to save Kotaku by going after the streamers and the YouTubers. We already know she's going after Melanie Mac, so who else is going to end up in that hit piece? Well, we've got a bit of an idea now from Grums. And then they came for Asmongold again. Kotaku senior editor-in-chief Alyssa Mercante is looking for people who regularly watch Asmongold and witness the shift firsthand. A shift, hmm? A, a shift to what? A far-right reactionary? Yeah, that's what she's going to want you to believe. Uh, however, Asmongold <laughs> is far from that. How many times do we need to teach you this lesson, old man? More like young boy. If she wants to know what the motivation or reasoning is behind my content, she can just DM me directly. Does she have you blocked and follow you at the same time she does me? I have no idea, lol. And then we have to see Alyssa's butt gross, which has a tattoo that reads, All men are enemies. Oh yeah, she's a sex worker too, if you didn't know. And she better be prepared to deliver those 100k game guides or face layoff. Someone should put up a web counter of how far behind she is on gaming guides each day that passes, yes. Disbrew says, trying to paint Asmin as right wing is one of the most laughable things I've heard. Melanie, of course, says, that's going to be comical if she's trying to lump him in on the conservative hit piece with me, when he very openly has very different views than me. Mm, unless Mercante is probably not going to see it that way. It seems like they try to cancel him three or four times a year. If you didn't know, they just try to cancel him from some Dragon's Dogma stuff. Because he doesn't like the poor, precious, sweet baby ink. Reactionary! Again, like all of these tweets from Grums, Kotaku reporter says I'm a bad person because I checked notes. Quoted Star Wars. She's definitely got an agenda and obsessed too. Is this your king? Calls out Grums. If you're championing a culture war so you can see bigger bazongas in video games, yes please. I'm. That's not really why I'm doing this, but definitely a good reason. And quoting Star Wars to embolden people, you have lost the fucking plot. You are LARPing your way through life. Just like how Alyssa's LARPing as a young boy. Deeply, deeply unserious. But with an army of 12-year-olds at your behest. Worrying. An army of 12-year-old boys that look very, very similar to Alyssa Mercante. Woman nagging about video game bazanga sells hers for money. <laughs> Gross! Kotaku writer follows me again after she claims she only accidentally followed me the first time. Totally not stalker behavior. She followed Grums? Far right reactionary. 100% confirmed Alyssa Mercante is an alt writer. We got her, boys. We got her. She's probably about to vote for Trump. Sick her. Totally sane behavior, Lamau. All men are enemies. What is that? <laughs> no, gross. My guy, she has lost it and is just on a hating spree to try to paint you as the villain, but she fell into her own trap. Uno reverse. She's deaf, got a list, and I am... Mm, I'm working hard. I'm going to get that documentary out there. I'm going to get on that list. Well, that giant. Please like and subscribe. I'm getting so close to 20K, and if I can just hit 20K and I can get that documentary out, I know I can make it on Mercanti's list. She's gone full frost. Never go full frost. Pre-Kotaku, post-Kotaku. I keep joking about how now that I'm a games journalist, I'm thinking about changing my gender, obviously. And seeing this really makes that less of a joke. I also like how the diddler is trending right next to her. <laughs> Grum sums it up well. Damn. Followed by another good explanation from Dan Vask. She's genuinely insane. I guess she's doing a hit piece on you next. <laughs> I'm trying to get on that list too. Ooh, John De La Rose. Yeah, let's get him on that list as well. Is that the prostitute? <laughs> So A44 Games told Cabrutus they'd removed all sweet baby content and asked to not be out on his curator list. When Cabrutus asked them to prove it, they actually refused to talk to him. I think I know why. I found the COO of A44 that hired Sweet Baby Inc. Also did this talk on DEI. No wonder. Tackling inclusion and diversity in the games industry. We're talking about Andrea Tops Hard Joe. Also looks like a boy. These studios don't need SBI to wokeify their games. They're already doing it, and SBI just comes in to say, mm, no, let's do this, no, no, let's do a little that, and then woke check mark. Occasionally they listen to them, occasionally they don't. The whole damn industry is infected with the woke mind virus. 
This post is unavailable, but we can assume what it said. Grums replied with, I'm not white. <laughs> why would why would he say something like that? I love how they automatically assume that if someone disagrees with them, that person must be white. Kind of racist if you ask me. Kind of racist if you ask me as well. And then Grums got me all worked up with this one. Everyone who wants to understand where the woke mind virus is going should watch this scene from the three body problem. This is why we have to fight it now rather than later. They're trying to put us into a sci-fi dystopia that we can never escape. If we wait to fight it, then it's not going to work. We have to stop it from ever happening. If it happens, it's too late. Sounds crazy, right? You heard of the cultural revolution. Has happened, is happening, and will continue to happen. And Cabrutus with a pretty poorly made meme with an excellent point. It's always good to remember important stuff. Gatekeeping is okay. It prevents franchises from going downhill. Nobody cares if your feelings get hurt. If you're a real fan and your feelings get hurt, you'll stick around. So how do you think this Alyssa Mercante hit piece is going to turn out? You think all of us chuds are going to get owned? We're going to have to crawl back down into our basements defeated by Kotaku? Or is it going to blow up in their face? Let me know down below. Give me a like if you could. And if somehow you're not subscribed, please. I'm almost at 20k. Please. My channel is under attack. And only you can stop it by hitting that subscribe button. And until I see you next time, I'll be working hard on the Gamergate 2 report and Gamergate 2 documentary, which I'll have finished at To Be Determined.